follow the protocol is very helpful. I mean, there are people who have come very close to people who are positive, but because of the adherence to the use of the mask in particular, others test positive, they don't. And so it works. And so probably we don't really have to push ourselves to that way because uh, this has both economic, social, and health consequences. And so we need to look at the two and make sure we, we, we get that done. Concerning the debt, we have recorded a little more than even 32 in January. Uh, it continued to update. And, and that is why this phase, we are creating the caution that people must follow the protocols. People must um, abide by the protocols and report early. There are people who stay home, they buy oxygen in their homes until it's too late before they come. We're trying to encourage that. And some of our colleagues who are going to people's home and giving them oxygen, please, they should stop. Anybody found will be severely dealt with because that is not part of our ethics and that's not part of our treatment protocol. And I think it's something that we really need to put out there. People must come in early. Don't buy oxygen and keep in your home. Buy your pulse oximeter and then and stay home until you can barely breathe, then you come. And I think that's what's causing uh, the death. And so we hope that people will follow that. Mm -hmm.